So let's, uh, let's go back to Bruma, actually. Travel to a, a Oblivion Gate? Oh, yeah, that's, that's it, right? A Oblivion Gate? That's not grammatically correct, is it? Okay, so that's, that's already destroyed. Let's go to Castle Bruma then, see if we can potentially talk to somebody over there. I don't know you, and I don't care to know Shut you. Shut up, dude. Stop being so rude. There's... Okay, there we go. Hello. Oh, no, that... Why is a Bruma guard doing sitting here? That's odd. Okay, we are going to... Wait 10 hours. Till it's daytime. Hopefully, the count would be just sitting here. And the moment of truth. There it is. Oh, count... Tess, I guess. I think I know why you're here. But I'd speak to my herald, Tolgan, first. I believe he has something for you. Then return to me. Okay, Tolgan. Where is Tolgan? Are you Tolgan? Well, in your... Good day. I'm Tolgan. Herald to Countess Narina Cardane here in Bruma. She requests your company at your earliest convenience. Uh, what is this regarding? Countess Carbane would prefer if you speak to her in person. She also said to present you with this stipend as a taste of things to come. My lady holds court from 8 in the morning until 6 in the evening each day. That would be the best time to see her. I mean, it's kind of weird that that's it. Just 25 gold. That's what I'm worth to her. She, I literally talked to her first. She said, talk to him. And then I talked to him. And she, he says, talk to her. Okay, whatever. So, Countess Carvain. The Countess is in attendance. Please observe proper etiquette. That's it? That's all you gotta say? I've heard much about your deeds from my people in Bruma. I trust the stipend Tolgan gave you whetted your appetite. Not at all. <laughs> That's why I'm here. Good point. Allow me to formally introduce myself. I'm Countess Narina Cavain. I assume you've noticed all the Akaviri relics I'm displaying. Well, it's safe to say I'm a collector of sorts. I've invested a great deal of time and money acquiring these bits of ancient history. In fact, I'd be so bold as to proclaim my collection the most complete in all Cyrodiil, perhaps even beyond. Except for one thing. A particular relic has eluded me for many years. Possessing this piece of Akaviri antiquity would make my collection complete. I'm, of course, referring to the Draconian Madstone. What's the Draconian Madstone? The stone is a fine bit of Akaviri craftsmanship. Worn like an amulet, this talisman is said to protect the wearer from poisons of any type. The Madstone appears as a snake coiled around and encircling itself. The eyes of the snake are supposed to be precious gems or some such. Through my sources, I've learned that the last reported location of the Madstone was the ruins at Pale Pass. Okay, Pale Pass. Are you familiar with the history of Pale Pass? No. Back at the end of the First Era, raiders from the continent of Akavir attempted to gain a foothold here in Tamriel. At that time, the Empire was broken into smaller factions. Raymond Cyrodiil decided to unify them and form an army to repel the Akaviri raiders. The force became known as the Army of Raymond. The two armies clashed in what's now northern Cyrodiil. The Akaviri were strong and well supplied. But their greatest error was marching through Morrowind on the way to their objective and dismissing the response it would garner from Vivek. They didn't count on Lord Vivek forming an alliance with the Trident Kings of the Dreg. From Morrowind, he struck at their rear flank. Not only did this make the Akaviri fight on two fronts, it also cut off access to reinforcements and supplies from the sea. 
So the Alliance ended the conflict? Not quite. The army of Raymond knew that the organized Akaveri forces were commanded from a hidden post in the mountains. Rumors placed it in a snowy vale called Pale Pass. That's where Raymond focused his attention. As his forces fought their way across the Gerald Mountains, the Akaviri suddenly surrendered. It was assumed they were overwhelmed and gave up. The only strange part was that the command post and Pale Pass were never found. It was dismissed as a rumor and the army of Raymond celebrated. It's come to my attention that the post did exist, and it happens to be the last reported location of the Draconian Madstone. Okay, so tell me more about this Draconian, Mad, uh, Draconian Madstone. If you retrieve the Draconian Madstone for me, I'll be happy to compensate you by rewarding you with another Akaviri artifact. Are you game? Yeah, sure, of course. I had a feeling you'd accept. Good. Then let me tell you how you're going to find the Madstone. I've come into the possession of a diary written by an Akaviri messenger. I suspect that the text within can lead you to the ruins. Here's a translation of the passages we could still read. It was quite damaged. I've also included a rough map that was drawn in the diary as well. I'm also providing you with a unique key that was supposedly found with the diary. I'm assuming it'll prove useful when you arrive at the site. Uh, diary? I paid several scouts to try and find the ruins at Pale Pass before I hired you. They were only able to locate the first of a series of landmarks. These landmarks are mentioned within the diary. The one referred to as Dragonclaw Rock has been located. I'll mark it on your map. The rest is up to you. My scouts reported bitter, cold and dangerous creatures in the area, so they couldn't proceed. Be cautious and return home soon. Good luck. Okay, so we're good. But that's May not the... the ahead be free of danger. That's not the quest I was looking for. So what I'm gonna end up doing... If it's not here... So yeah, if it's not here, then uh, it's it's at the uh, at Cloud Ruler Temple, the defense for Bruma. So I'm not going to go there because I'm also on a mission that I need to get some armor for Martin, and Martin is at Cloud Ruler Temple. So I might be able to knock out two birds with one stone. So where is this map? Can I fast travel there? I haven't discovered it yet. So let's go at least to the caverns is probably the closest place I've discovered to there. And we have a long way to go. Well, this thing is uh, faster than walking, but it's definitely not fast at all. Let's go. Well, horse is stuck. There we go. There you go, buddy. See, you can climb mountains. You can climb mountains. You can something, something, something. <laughs> All right. This is going to get old fast if I can't climb this mountain. I need that armor for Martin. This petty little mountain will not be what stops me from getting it. Whoa, that was close. That wolf really wanted me. And he still wants me because he's following me. Whoa. Get away from me, you beast. How long do they follow you? Heh. <laughs> he might die before I even before he even uh, decides to reset. I gotta be careful. I'm not trying to die here either. Oops. How far are we? Oh my god, we're barely halfway there. We'll get there in no time, actually. Let's 
Excuse me, coming through. Oh my god, let me guess, that's another wolf. Yeah, it is. You... Wolf need to get away from me, please. I've got a biz- I got some business to take care of. With some armor. Okay, I'm about three quarters of the way there. Uh... Maybe I should take this bridge. If I could even climb up there. Come on, horsey. You got this, man. You got this. Oh my god, bro. I'm, I'm, I'm almost there. This is it. The final push, horsey. Nice. Good job. I'm proud of you. This is the king of all climbing horses. We shall name him Philip of Rivia. We have to be close. Ow! That hurt. How many wolves do we have to get? Oh, we're here. We're definitely here. The Gerald Mountains. How do I get in there? That's my biggest question right now. Wait, how do I get, how do I get off the horse? There it goes. Leave my horse alone, you crazy SOB. Let's go. I like that my horse helps fight, by the way. Come on, get out of my way. I'm not trying to accidentally kill my horse either, though. It's about time. My god. Oh, and of course there's still another one left. It's just an archer, though. I'm not really worried about it. Okay, I found the entrance. I have found the entrance to the catacombs of Sang uh, Sanker Tor. I'm probably butchering that name, by the way. I should search for them, uh, search them for the Shrine of Tiber Septum. Don't worry. I will find it. What is this? Bone meal? No, thank you. I have no interest for a meal made out of bone. Haha! -ha. I have been victorious. Alright, there's nothing that way. Man, coming into these caves really make me happy that ESO did a good job at recreating these these places. Of course in the game they're a lot bigger though, but still. He didn't stand a chance. How big is this, anyways? Oh, it's a loop-de-loop. Because -loop. of course it is. You can't touch me. You can't touch me. Let's pull the lever so that we may progress.
It's like oddly quiet here. Hello. Why is he glowing? Haha. Didn't stand a chance. That's a I'm taking that. Wait, what is that? Oh, snap. I do not know how long I have been dead. It feels like an eternity. What happened to you? My three companions and I were sent here by the Emperor Tiber's symptom to discover what evil had defiled the whole of Sankut. We did not know that the Underking, who was here an artist, had risen to take his first revenge upon his former lord. The Underking defeated and ensnared us in his evil enchantment and bound us here to guard forever. Is the Under King still here? No. He departed long ago. But his evil will remain, preventing any from paying homage at the shrine of Tiber Septum. Over the uncounted years of our slavery here, we have brooded over our defeat. I believe So do I. He talks so painfully I slow. To complete my duty to my lord, free my brothers, and together we may be able to lift the under king's curse. Farewell. Sounds like a plan to me. <laughs> Why do you disturb? No. I'm not trying to talk to you. I'm trying to search this body. I think I left something else. Ancient Blade's helmet? It does two defense. What does mine do? Three defense. So mine's better, period. It's cool though that it's there, but don't really need it, do I? So we gotta free the two other brothers, because he said there was three, right? Or was it him plus three more in total four? I don't know. The answer is three or four, one of those. Hello. Come here. So there's one, two. Yeah, two more. So I think it's three. Hold on. So this is where I have to go for the final fight, apparently. <sighs> I want to save the brothers, too. Or the... The other two. Hall of Judgment, this said? Alright, yeah, whatever it is I'm looking for, it's around here somewhere. Yeah, I'm not worried about him. Haha. 
Come here. Dunzo. Dude, I'm invincible. You guys can't fight me. Makes you think you can fight me. No, that's not it. That's definitely not it. But this guy needs to die for sure. Get away from me. You slimy SOB, you. <clears throat> so it's gotta be this way if it's not that other way. But it... Old wooden door. Okay, I was about to say, I thought this was gonna take me somewhere else, but it didn't. Nice try. And done. He's gotta be here, right? This seems like it will be he like he would be here. Oh, let me kill this guy first. All right, good. He's dead. Yeah, the, the other guy seems like he would be around here somewhere. Will you just die? Thank you. Appreciate it. He's definitely down there. How do I get there, though? Oh my god, how many ghosts are there here? Get out of here, you apparition. There he is. I'm coming to save you. Don't worry, you will be freed from the torment that you must be feeling. Haha. -ha. I have done it. You know what? I'm going to I'm going to take it. Just because it's an ancient helmet. I've destroyed the second cursed blade guarding Sankor Tor. Freeing his spirit to help his companions lift the Under King's enchantment from the Shrine of Time Perceptum. I should continue to search for the other two undead blades. Okay, yeah, so. There was a few of them. Is that a unique weapon? It is. That makes me want to go back to the first guy I killed to find out if I have... It's not that good, though. Whoops. There we go. I quit. I'm gonna literally just end up wasting all of my lockpicks, so no thank you. Excuse me. Coming through. Okay. Should I go to the first guy I killed? Uh, no, let's just go this way. It's gotta be around here somewhere, right? Well, this was a dead end. So let's not go this way then. Let's go back the other way. <clears throat> Excuse me, Mr. Ghost Guard Guy Dude that I saved. I need to save two other of your friends. I really wish I could run faster right now. But I can't. Because this game hates me. Is it... Is it this way? Yeah, this was one of them over here. Uh, 
Uh, and we have a green mark. That's a good thing. Oh, there he is! Don't worry, my friend. I'm here. To end your torment. Also, so that you can save me. He's got an- he's got a- a blade shield, too. Would you just die? So this is- what does it say? North wind. I've destroyed the third of the- the third? Cursed blades, guarding secretor. I need to find and destroy the last- oh, we got one more. Of the cursed blade so that his freed spirit can help the ghost of his companions dispel the evil enchantment blocking the way to the shrine of Tiber, Tiber Septum. So this is North Wind. This shield is probably unique too. Ancient blade shield? No, it's not. But still, regardless, I'm still taking it. Let's look at it. North Wind. Oh, it does frost damage. And it does one more damage than my- but I think this Akaveri blade is better because it also deteriorates armor and weapons. So I think this is better. And then I did pick up an ancient shield. That really... Hold on, is it better? No, it's not. It's one less. It's also not worth anything. So I'm curious to find out whether... It's worth picking these things up. Hello. So he's going... Where is he going? Well, alright then. He just straight up disappeared. Off the face of the earth. Hello? Haha, nice try. We've got to be close to it. We got one more, so that last guy better have a pretty cool unique weapon. Or armor piece. Or shield. Which I guess is an armor piece, I guess. What is this thing anyways? I don't know. Looks cool though. And done skis. Hello. Come here. Stop backing up. You have to be destroyed by my blade. There's nothing in here. Oh wait, this is no it continues. Nice try. Where does this lead to? Another area. Dude, I'm like going all over the place. Also, I don't want to drown. Where does this go? Does it even go anywhere? Oh, okay. There we go. That was magical. Wait, am I back at the beginning? Yeah, this is back at the beginning. So, where is the last guy? gotta be this way after I do this one I'm gonna go back to the previous area to the first area I should say and see if I uh, the other dude dropped a, a unique weapon the first guy haha -ha. so the last guy is definitely in this room somewhere Where are you? 
It's definitely... Oh, he blocked me good. Try to block that, homeboy. Haha. Is that a unique? Nope. Oh, I'm... I'm not doing that. No, thank you. Wait, do I have to go in there? No, I don't. Because this guy had the key the whole time. I was about to say, man. Okay, let's go ahead and kill this dude. Done and done. Um. So that's a dead end. So it looks like this is the only way we can go. This place seems kind of confusing. But it's really just a straightaway. Alright, let's kill this guy. I don't want him chasing me the whole time. Also, let's rep. Oh, I can't rest with enemies nearby? Who's nearby? How rude. I wanted to level up already. You, I'm coming for you. Hello, where are you, Mr. Bladesman guy or guard guy, whatever your name is? Is he down here? There he is! We have found him! Here, come back out here. There's more room out here. I want to know exactly where you dropped the sword. Haha! -ha. The first two were misses, but it's okay. Dude, one more one more big hit and he should be dead. I was wrong. There we go. So what is where am I? This is Vladimir's shield. All of the cursed blades of Sankar Tor have been destroyed. Their freed spirits have gone to the Shrine of Tiber Sephiroth to try to dispel the enchantment laid upon by the Under King long ago. I should go to the Shrine at once to see if they succeed in their final quest. Yes, but I want Vladimir's shield first. Okay, let's see what I got. Vladimir's shield reflects 6% damage. Well, this is definitely better than what I have on. Just because it's legendary or unique. Because it both weighs the same. They both block 10. Sorry, but I, I got, I got, I have to. It's just better. This one does. No. I'm keeping this one. I'm coming up with a bunch of good stuff here, aren't I? Oh crap, this one's a dead end. Vladimir, you bastard, you literally made me go the wrong direction. There's gotta be a quick way to get out of here, no? Maybe if I go this way? What about this way? Nope, yep, I gotta go all the way back. Hold on, let's check the final room. Yep. I gotta go all the way back. That sucks. But it's okay, though. Because we got, like, four unique weapons and, uh, and shields here. Maybe I should put on the Akaviri stuff. Or the blade stuff, I should say. Maybe I should. What do you guys think? 
You think I should uh, put on the uh, blades equipment instead of the guards, the legion guards? Let me know down in the comment section. Alrighty. We should be almost out of here. Yeah, this is it right here. So before we go and progress though, I'm going to say it one more time. I'm going to... Is this Vladimir? Valdemir. I keep saying Vladimir. Alright, I'm going to go to the previous section because I, I really want to make sure he didn't drop a unique weapon. So I'm not entirely sure. Undead blade? It's just an ancient. I'm trying to see if there's anything down there. There is. There's a freaking shield down there. I'm going. It's just an ancient blade shield. That was a waste. Okay. It's okay though. The good thing is. We checked, we got peace of mind. Now we can go and take on the ancient spell or whatever. Knock knock. It should just it should just be down the stairs, right? Alrighty, this should be it. Look at all the blades. That's cool. What does that mean though? What are you doing? I have found the Shrine of Tiber Septum. Uh, its entrance is blocked by some sort of enchantment. I will have to find a way to dispel the enchantment in order to reach the armor inside the shrine. Okay, that's where the blades come in. So they need to do some sort of spell or something, right? The ghost of the four cursed blades have dispelled the evil enchantment of the Shrine of Tiber, Se Tiber Septum. The way to the armor is now open. Oh. That was nothing spectacular. It just kind of happened. Okay. Yeah, sure. Why not? Can I have the armor of Tiber Septum? I have the armor of Tiber Septum. Now I must take it to Martin at Cloud Ruler Temple. Can I put it on? Oh, yes. That looks cool. It's not very good though. It only does 10 damage. It blocks 10 damage. I'm putting my other stuff back on. Where's that? Where's my chest piece? There it is. Oh, well, this does 8, so I guess it is better. But it doesn't have any legendary effects or anything. So that kind of sucks. Since everyone's dead, let's go ahead and holster. Can I talk to them? Toodles. So that's he's gone. I think I gotta talk to him one that one by one. I want them all to be gone. Well, I think I already talked to him all, but okay, you guys are good. See you later, guys. Bye, Toodles. I gotta go back to Cloud Ruler Temple now. Need to give this special, awesome looking armor to Martin. Because up until now, he's been literally wearing a robe the entire time. He can't go to combat. He can't go to war with a robe. I mean, I guess you can, but... You're going to be squishy. How do I get out of here? It's got to be the way, right? This is all foggy and confusing, I swear. This has to be the exit, right? I don't know. Uh, 
All right. Did I? This is a cool little dungeon thing, but it's a little, it's a little confusing. Yeah, this is the exit. Really? Where'd you come from? Okay, well let's go fast travel, actually, to Cloud Ruler Temple. See you later, hors horsey. Is there an armor here too that I can literally just repair all my stuff to? That'd be great. Soldier to soldier. Are we not blades? Joined by battle and brotherhood? Need you even ask? The plane of oblivion. We know so little about it. Okay. I'm just gonna go talk to Martin. Oh, I forgot I have all my stuff there still. <laughs> Martin, where are you? Don't tell me you're asleep. Hail. Hail. He's asleep, isn't he? I'm gonna go ahead and just rest. I don't have to wait that long, but still. That's fine. Hey, what's up, Martin? What do you need, friend? I'm... My progress on the Mysterium Xarxes is slow, I'm afraid. How goes your search for the armor of Tiber Septim? As a matter of fact, I have it here. The Septim blood may flow through my veins, but you have the soul of a hero. The armor of Tiber Septim himself. Joffrey will be amazed to see it. You can reassure Joffrey that I will not destroy the armor. All I need is a scraping of Talos's divine blood. The blades are as touchy as priests about relics of Tiber Septim, it seems. So what else can I do to help? While you were gone, I've made some progress in deciphering the Mysterium Xarxes ritual. The third item we need is a great Welkin stone. You may have run across lesser Welkin stones. They're fairly common in alien ruins, but a great Welkin stone will not be easy to come by. They have been plundered one by one over the years due to their great value to mages and occultists. There is only one place that is rumored to still contain one. The ruins of the Aeliad city of Miskarkand. A place where many have perished seeking its great stone. But nothing else will do, so you must succeed where all others have failed. I will. Tell me more about this place. The capital of one of the ancient Aeliad kingdoms which flourished in Cyrodiil before the rise of men. It is said that the ruins are still haunted by the vengeful spirit of its last king. True or not, it is not a place to enter lightly. Be careful. The Great uh, Welkin Stone? The pinnacle of Aeliad magic. Once, every Aeliad city had its great stone, but they've all been plundered over the centuries. All but one. The Great Stone of Miskarkand is reputed still to shine in the deep darkness of its ruined halls. But no one has ever done more than glimpse it from a distance. It is said to be guarded by the ghost of the last king of Miskarkand. So tell me more about Miskarkand. Miskarkand is one of the most extensive Aeliad ruins in Cyrodiil. It was the capital of one of the ancient Aeliad kingdoms. You might find glories and laments among the Aeliad ruins useful. I have the library's copy at my table if you need it. Okay, thank you. Be careful, my friend. I know you've braved many dangers already, but Miskarkand is not to be taken lightly. Okay, I'll take it heavy then. Um, where is Miskarkand anyways? Uh, active quest, Miskarkand. It's actually between Kovach and Skingrad. I can't fast travel there, I don't think. Because I don't think I've ever... ...been there. I do kind of want to do this, though. Miskarkand. So, yeah, I think we are definitely going to be doing that. Yeah, we should probably do that right now, actually. Whoops. Whoops. Uh, canceled. <laughs> Return. Oh my god. Alright, let's go.